Pisces, welcome to your money and career reading for May moving into June. I'm Robin Carline from Robin's Authentic Tarot and thank you for visiting my channel. Let's see what Spirit has in store for you. Way too many. Oh, here we go. Oh, oh, there you go. Oh, I love that. Oh my gosh. Infinite abundance. That is amazing. Oh my gosh. Infinite you manifesting. Oh my gosh. You have everything that you need. I love that. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. So this comes up as your, your challenge. So the sun. So this is the solar plexus energy with a bit of that sacral chakra there. We're going to get into that in a moment. I want to see how this is going to form belief energy. Oh my. Overflowing abundance. Okay. Pisces. Mm, okay, there we go. I see something here. So relationship with self. So this is the root. So when I say like when it says the lovers, yes, it means relationships to everything. And that means your abundance. That means the money that you are creating. So when this comes out, this definitely shows me what could be the challenge. So with this root here, this is the way that you're manifesting. So with that sacral chakra here, the sacral chakra, that is your relationship to everything and how you're how you are um, manifesting how you are attracting things to yourself. So with the attracting the abundance, the money, and I mean, like overall abundance, but for this uh, reading, we're talking about money, we're talking about your career, your business. So in a, in that aspect, there there definitely is that that self worth, there is the self love. So with this here for the rest of this card, which is representing the fire energy, which is which is the solar plexus energy. And so with that, that's your willpower, your confidence, that is you stepping out in your comfort zone, I feel that in a very big way. So with this being the root and immediately, I always go to self. So you yourself and your relationship to yourself, that is the most important relationship, hands down. And then all of the relationships after that, so with a significant other, with children, with friends, with coworkers, those are all secondary, but the relationship with yourself is the first. So the relationship with how you're attracting things into your life is, is the big thing. And that is the biggest thing now you have like manifestation and abundance like those like you've got like big cards here you have really big cards here um in fact you have one ace and then you have three major arcana so those are like big events these are big things that are happening pisces there's like a big shift that's going to be happening for you oh here oh wow for your present energy, <laughs> might as well put this one back up again. <laughs> wow. Okay, so this is about partnerships, but and this is this is see that orange there? So that's that that sacral chakra. So and that cup energy. So it's that water energy. This is sacral chakra, and seeing here the serpents the intertwinement, the partnership. Again, first thing, relationship with self. But also, there is relationships, now this showing up as relationships with other people. So in the business, and again, with the money and how you're attracting it, how you're building it, how you're growing it. So that's all extremely, um, 
<laughs> shown here in this reading like that is phenomenal and so the two of of cups it, it's a very good very positive card so for your future card okay all right so we are still in the cup energy and this is that warrior energy. So right here, you can see that this knight, this warrior is cool, calm and collected. So this one having that very, um, just trotting along, everything is going okay. So loving that it feels that your relationship to yourself, your relationship to um, your abundance. Oh, lovely. There was a whole bunch and then this one flipped out. So I'm just gonna Throw those over there they all flipped out and I didn't see any of I only saw this one here so um but yeah so relationship like basically in in every single card and now here's your internal energy so this is the first one really that um is not of the uh water energy the cup energy this is air energy and what I really love about this there's a couple of things there's the pillars. So anytime there's a pillar, it's kind of like, it, it could be like a doorway. So when you have the pillars on either side, it's like you're moving in your, and you're moving out into something new. So things are going to be okay. Uh, working, we sorry, working out for you justice. And I didn't mean, okay. I meant things, things are, things are working out. Okay. Um, and this one here with the scales, the scales are balanced. Like this is so incredibly positive, so incredibly positive. So definitely, like I've been saying all along, your relationship with self, the relationship, how you are building things, how you are attracting things to yourself, how you are building partnerships and growing whatever it is that you are doing, whether it is uh, in the finance or whether it is in the business or in the career, it's it, it all starts with a look within. Okay, so we had way too many cards um, come out there. Now there were three, I'm just gonna throw those, those were cool, um, but these are also just as cool. And I'm gonna take the four. So I'm not taking seven, I'm taking four. <laughs> so this one here, Pisces, this is victory. This is beautiful, that's external energy. So I love how all of your energy, all your water, beautiful energy, and uh, just showing up like in, in such strength. I love that. Now, you also have pentacle energy and this is completion. This is success. This is like you are building things. And what this represents is that this is the external. This is what you can harness. You harness, you bring that abundance in and you manifest this abundance. That is awesome. I love that. Now you have celebration you have community you have people that are so happy for your success and want to celebrate your success this is also you noticing that orange that's your relationship to you celebrating your success sometimes when we have successes we can just kind of let them fly by and just be like yeah okay whatever and, and not really think that you're worthy enough to be like oh my gosh yes i did it i've been working so hard for this yes tell your like-minded people tell your friends your co-workers people are going to celebrate people are going to be very very happy for you that energy is out there that is your external mm. Knight of Pentacles again. So here is another like calm, cool, collected knight, warrior. And this is beautiful because that is the foundational energy. So that warrior energy that is ready, that is ready with, look at, look at this. So there's all of this land here, all of this root chakra, all of this root energy, that all of the pentacle earth energy, 
that is that is it's open for you to create it's open for you to build on and here is that warrior that knight that's holding on to that pentacle and admiring that and saying yes like look at this this is what i did i conquered and i won and so that is your external energy this is like um so incredibly like high vibe high vibe energy um but the thing is is you believing it for yourself you really pumping yourself up pump yourself up know that you are worthy you have the confidence you have the willpower you have everything so this is hopes dreams and fears oh there we go Ooh, so here is more of your energy pisces and this is new offers that's that page so there's that newness and with this cup here it's full your cup is full but it also has a fish it has a fish in it and what does that represent it represents that like um well what i feel is the swimming upstream so there's a lot of work there's a lot of strength a lot of strength a lot of determination it's like that night energy like and so with the with this energy here with that sacral chakra this is the water as well so there could be you know what you not celebrating yourself but also that you don't necessarily believe that that this could ap ap that this could actually happen for you here you have like that yellow here so that is that root but it's also like it's part of the uh three lower chakras which is that yellow which is like standing on solid ground standing on your foundation and having that confidence, having that willpower. And for your completion card. Ooh. This is my favorite queen. And it is my favorite queen because there is the clarity. There is, there is speaking your mind. There's definitely stepping into your power. The queen being um, strong, really strong, very intuitive, knowing that deep, deep knowing, that intuition. So with that air energy that represents the throat chakra, the third eye chakra, and the crown chakra. So um, there is some sass. There is some sass to the queen, which means speaking your mind and saying, this is what I want. I'm not going to accept any less. This is what I'm creating. Like this is super creative. So also this air energy is representing the age of Aquarius. So that's that universal energy that we are in for the next 2000 years. And so with this new era energy, this is like so much innovation, so much creativity, so much self-expression. And you're all about that. You are all about that. Pisces, I love that. So this is a big, huge, like, I don't even know the word. I don't even know the word, like a big, huge dollop or dose or even bigger than that. I don't know. What's a big word? Um, <laughs> what is a big, huge word? Like you need like, like just so much. I can't even enormous, enormous. There's enormous, but it's that confidence. It's that, it's that, um, self-worth. It's that self-love, like knowing that you can do it. You can do it. You can do it. It's all here. <laughs> it's all here. It's all here. You can do it. I, I mean, it is all here. That That's what you're being told. Infinitely. Infinitely. <laughs> like, look at that. Abundance. And it's coming out to you. It's being offered. Oh, my gosh. Relationship with self. Everything is working out. Money. Money. 
success, victory, celebration, new offers, speaking your mind. It's beautiful. I love it. Pisces, thank you so much for showing up for yourself. Thank you for coming and listening to me. And thank you for all of your support for my channel. I love you all.